You know, it's been interesting to see these calls for justice coming from uh, people of all racial backgrounds. I don't know if you had a chance to see some of the video of the, the faces that were in the protest groups here in New York City. It's been really interesting to me to see how diverse the protesters are. It is a group that is largely young. Um, what do you make of that, that it, the youth are having this conversation and driving it? I know that there are many voices contributing to these calls for justice, but what do you make of this call from the youth? Well, this maybe is the real America showing its head again. After all, that is the protest combination that President Barack won with. We've seen this awful ideological polarization in the last uh, six years and made us think this is the real America. But the real fact is we got the right to vote. McKinley in 1965, blacks couldn't vote. White women couldn't serve on juries. 18-year-olds mm. couldn't vote. You couldn't vote on college campuses. You could not vote by language. It was that coalition, not a post-racial, but a, a post-Selma generation that came into being the real, a real America. So when I see them, I see the rainbow blossoming and I see Dr. King's dream of being realized.